Ah, from the very start. This place looks kind of cool. That is how I found my way here. Where is here exactly? And who are you? And what do you know of King Solomon's army? We are Razia, Queen of the Murid, Guardian of the Waters, and ally to King Solomon himself. We helped to seal that army away. That would have been more than a thousand years ago. You couldn't possibly... I am of the Jinn. We are not so short-lived as humans, or so quick to forget things of vital importance. Do you know what your brother has unleashed? That army did not belong to King Solomon. It was sent to destroy him. The army was formed from the desert sand itself. It is a disease. The more sand it touches, the more soldiers it will create. If you do not trap it quickly, it will cover the world. How can I stop it? Do you still have the half of the seal you picked up? Of course. Good. That is a powerful magic. Alone it will help you fight the army. If you reunite the two halves, you will recreate its prison. You must find the other half of the seal and match it to this one. Malik still has it. Then you must find him, and quickly. We will give you the help of the Jinn. What did you do? If you wish to stop the army, you will need more time. I have given it to you. Time? And a final warning. The army is led by Ratash, one of the Ifrit. He will likely seek out the medallion. If you see him, do not fight him. You cannot hope to win against him. I'll keep that in mind. Go. There is no hope of this kingdom if you do not have the light to see. Why do I get the feeling this won't be as easy as it sounds? Ah, it didn't even sound very easy to me. Okay. We have our mission. Oh, it's a little painting. It's another painting over there. I guess let's go back to where we came from. The Jinn and the Ifrits. What was that place? Rewinding time. Just like in the first one. That's good. You can rewind all the way back here. You see the little thing at the top left. That's how far you can rewind. Oh, come on. Oh, now we get blue stuff as well to fill up our time thing. Everything is falling apart. Why would you die from such a small fall? You were much cooler before. 
Yeah, okay. Stop it. No more rewind time. Oh. Okay, 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 okay. Run and jump. We've already used up a little bit too much time. These are the stables. I can get to the fortress through here. Well, I guess it's time to start fighting I can't even hear the, battle anymore. the real monsters. Well, there's a lot of them. Oh, hey, now we get experience. That's good. Mowing them down. Oh, snappity snap. Upgrade. What's our choices? Health increase or energy slot? And then they go into other things here. So if you unlock a health increase, we can unlock later on stone armor. And then trail of flame. And battle rage and so on and so on. If we have like an energy slot, we can go to whirlwind, ice blast, and power attack and stuff. Let's go energy slot then. Alright, so now we got Whirlwind. Well, no, actually we don't. We only have one extra energy slot. But soon enough, we'll have Whirlwind. We're gonna own everyone. Okay. Ugh. I keep doing that. I keep pressing jump when I should just run up the floor. I'm uh, sorry, wall. Big puzzly room. A lot of jumping. Nah, once we hang on to that one, that'll open up a door or something. Alright, let's get cracking. Piece of cake for the base. Not a problem. Um, actually, yeah. Just a little wall climbing, no big deal. Standard, really. Totally used to this. See, the interesting bit I find is that um, how he became this good in the first place. Like, okay, fair enough, in this game he's already been through the first one, so he's quite experienced. But if you grow up as a prince, I mean, although, yeah, you can be like an agile warrior or something, but all this wall jumping and stuff is pretty impressive stuff. Now we do a little jumping. Get out of my way, birds. I do, actually. Without incredibly lethal death traps. Once I'd like to find defenses that could tell me from an enemy. Oh okay. Yeah. I do I can understand that wish. Prince. That's why we need um, defense systems in the future. It's like computers. I can sense that sort of stuff. 
Oh snap, I accidentally pressed the rewind button. You know what? This is a tad too easy. Maybe I should put it on hard. Let's see. Where do I... I see lower difficulty, but I can't increase the difficulty. GG GG Ubisoft GG What do we have here? Oh, that almost No, that did work I guess we know where we're going next Again, I keep pressing the jump button too early. And now we flip it around. And jump. Much better. There we go. Oh, why did I do that? And P? I've got rewind. See? Fixing That's what makes... Really be so simple as reuniting the medallion halves. That's part of what makes these games so much better than um, just normal platformers. The fact that you can just... Um, oh, jump. Uh, I might have to jump actually right like this. Yeah, there we go. You can just restart when you fuck up because that happens all the time. In uh, platformers, you just do one mistake and you have to do everything from scratch again. But in this one, you're fine. As long as you have sand. Of course, by this one, I mean the series on its own. Of which I say Sands of Times is the best one. Hello, skeleton. Sucks to be you, Sand Skeletons. Perhaps these defenses do have their uses. Ow, 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 <laughs> oh, that's, that's kind of painful. Well, surprisingly, not so much, actually. Didn't really take that much damage from it. I guess I'm a bit sturdier. Some soldiers by now. Where is everyone? Oh, boy. I think there's your answer. Whoops, wrong button. Give me a break, they're right next to each other on the controller. Now what did that do? Yes, a nice little platform. Do I need to... Oh, we've got a... behind us. Convenient number of those things around. Um, where do we go from here? Oh, yeah, we change these back. No, we don't. 
maybe yes we do, yes. That thing in there possibly has something to do with it. Or just up here. No, no, we should have kept that. Well, actually, I still don't see where to go. Unless he can reach that. Nope, he can't. Then... Well, we gotta do something with this thing. This thing just came out after all. No, just leave it alone. Can I... Oh no, I need to, I need to, okay. So let's not be stupid here. Maybe we can drag it from this way. Yeah. You know, I... Maybe I could have done that from the very beginning, but... Um, I should have been able to do it from... Okay, that was a bit weird. A problem? Let's start spinning again. Why does he... No, hold on, I can do... There we go. And now we... Jump this way? And that's the second one. And then we can wall jump between those. First, of course, monster killing. I do think these should be a little bit harder. I'm basically just slashing and holding that direction here. They're really slow. Then again, for all I know, increasing the difficulty would just make them do more damage. That's usually the problem in games. You just you change the hard and all it does is make the numbers bigger. Oh, they have more HP. Oh, they're, they have more attack damage, basically. That's kind of what sucks about it. Anyway, let's find an upgrade. Might be something interesting now. Yeah, there we go. Whirlwind. Oh, is that Whirlwind? Okay, yeah.